One of the recent Google updates for theft detection and protection provides your Android to enable remote lock feature even if you are offline. In case someone stole your phone and ran away, you can remotely lock your device with PIN, pattern, password, biometrics, whatever is set into it. So let's check out how to turn on the remote lock on any Android like Samsung, Galaxy, Google Pixel, Motorola, Xiaomi, etc. running on the latest Android OS. Beforehand, you gotta turn this option on. And for that, you need to set up at least one screen lock, pin, pattern, or password. Now, since the device interface is different from Android to Android, whatever Android you are following us from, why don't you just go ahead, open up settings, and simply search for theft detection or remote lock. In Samsung, you'll find this in security and privacy section. Now, before you can turn the remote lock option, first, just go ahead, turn on offline device lock. So even if your device goes offline, Google can trace your number and still remotely lock your phone screen. Go to remote lock and then toggle on this use remote lock button. If you scroll down, you'll see your phone number is being verified automatically. If you face any problem in that, just tap on your phone number and make sure this automatically verify phone number option is turned on. That's all. Now trust me, your work is done. Now I'm gonna show you a live demo how it works. So let's say someone snatched this device and ran away with it. All you gotta do is just arrange another device, whatever it is, from the browser. Just search for android.com slash lock. Enter the site. Make sure it's showing the correct region. Put down the exact phone number that's been verified to your lost device. And then simply tap on device lock button. As you can see, your stolen device's screen will be immediately locked. And if it's an Android like Samsung, the thief cannot switch off your device unless they enter the lock screen password, which they do not have. And you know what? You can just track your Android through Find My by then. But please make sure you can try this out only twice in 24 hours. And that's pretty much how you can use the remote lock system on your Android. Thanks for watching.